Howdy everyone, WarsRC here, and this is Far Cry 4 on Xbox 360 in 2023. I've considered covering this game in the past, but this one was actually a viewer request of whom was my co-op partner for the duration of this gameplay, so without them, this video wouldn't have been possible. That said, let's get started. This is possibly my favorite Far Cry game. I know Far Cry 3 is a really good game that's considered by many to be the best one and that Far Cry 4 is less of a leap forward in the franchise and is just more Far Cry 3 with some minor enhancements, but I've always quite enjoyed this one. Besides maybe Voss, I'd say that Pagan Min is probably my favorite Far Cry villain. Whether that's an unpopular opinion or not, I have no idea, but I'm sticking to it. Either way, Far Cry 4 always seems to be the one that I return to every now and then. Ever since it came out, I just sort of latched onto it, and I've always found it fascinating, having played through every version except for the PC version. And while this and the rest of the Far Cry games are primarily single player focused, this game has multiplayer, so I've got a reason to cover it. While Far Cry 3 also had some sort of co-op missions, and previous games also had separate multiplayer modes, this, I believe, is the first Far Cry game where you could play regularly and just have someone join your regular game. So for this game, there's no content differences between versions. The current gen and last gen versions both target 30 FPS, but of course this and Far Cry 3 are notorious for running like crap on Xbox 360 and PS3. Which of them runs worse, I'm not sure, but both have some insane frame drops that happen quite often. That and screen tearing, which I'm certain you've probably seen a bit of in this footage. I know that back then this was more regularly accepted on consoles, but for anyone that's built higher expectations for performance over the years, or at least gotten used to more smoother experiences of modern gaming, it may be a little bit difficult going back to this at least the last gen versions. Regardless, it's a miracle that this even came out on Xbox 360 and PS3. And if you could ignore the performance, it's still playable. But let's talk about the multiplayer. Obviously I came into this game with the intent of playing with a viewer, but just for the sake of fairness, I did do the usual public lobby thing but I didn't end up finding anyone playing, which isn't surprising. However, thankfully, it's just co-op, meaning you only need one other person, so if you've got a friend, you can just send them an invite. Obviously not the most ideal way to play Far Cry 4 on the Xbox 360, but the point is, you can still play this online on the Xbox 360 and PS3, even if you have to find a friend to do so with first. You can still try to search for random lobbies or leave yours open for others, but if you do so, you're probably not going to have a whole lot of luck with that. In terms of picking this game up yourself or for a friend, this game goes on sale not too often, but every now and then I do see it get discounted digitally for under $10, and physical copies aren't too expensive, so if you're wanting to play this online on the Xbox 360 for some reason, it's still doable. The co-op, that is. I say that because there is one other mode, of course, for Far Cry 4, Battles of Kirat, which is a 5v5 multiplayer mode. I have experienced playing it in the past, and while the main meat of the game is the single player and co-op section, it's definitely a welcome addition, when there's people to play it with at least. Unfortunately, it seems to be dead even on current gen systems. I've tried in the past with a friend in public lobbies on the PS4 and it was only ever just the two of us. Still, for the sake of this video, I gave it a try and unsurprisingly, there was nobody playing it. So co-op is definitely your best bet with this game. Of course, in that, you'll only be messing around in the open world, liberating outposts and such, not able to do full-on story missions, but it's not hard to find things to do even if it is just throwing rocks at each other. There's a lot more to do than that, but my point is, there's a lot of fun you can make in this game. So in the end, yes, you can still play Far Cry 4 online on Xbox 360, but you'll probably need a friend to do so. Though, unless it just happens to be the only version you have on hand, you'd be better off picking up the next-gen versions, as those are playable on modern-day consoles. And that's going to be it for this video. Till next time, this is Warstarcy on the Game Clips channel, and I'm out.